Hey, how's it going? Parker Welbeck here with FullTimeFilmmaker.com and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you my color grading process using Lumetri Color inside Premiere Pro. Let's dive in. All right, so for the color grading process, I like to just stylize the footage a little bit more and give it more of a look. And we'll start by coming into our project, then up to File, New, Adjustment Layer, hit OK, and then drag that adjustment layer onto your timeline above all of your clips, stretch it out across the entire timeline, and then we're gonna add our color grade to that adjustment layer. Now you don't have to use a LUT, but this would be the time to use a LUT. So we're gonna close our basic correction and come into creative. And for a lot of the projects I do, I like to add just a little bit of orange and teal, not over the top, but just a little bit of complementary colors going in there. So we'll come into my personal LUT that you guys can buy off of LUTify, or if you're a member of the FTF course, it's included for free. So let's put that on there and you see the grade that instantly gets applied this is a personal preference thing you may hate the look altogether i like it there's the before and after just makes the blues a little more teal and just cleans up all the colors, making them on that spectrum of either orange or blue. If you look over here and we toggle that on and off, just condenses all of our colors to be sitting on that complementary color line, which is scientifically proven to be pleasing to the eye. So let's move forward then. So that's it for the creative tab. Next, I'd come into curves and I wanna make this look a little more poppy. It's generally my style. So I'm just gonna add a little curve to add a tad more contrast. And there's a before and after on that, just a bit more contrasty. Some people like flatter looks. I like a little more contrasty looks. Now coming down to hue versus saturation. First, I'd protect my skin tones which lie between there and there approximately and then I'm just going to play with my greens and my blues independently here for this video specifically I want to bring up the saturation of my greens a little bit more because we have a lot of green in the image and so I'm going to bring up my greens just a little bit more there and then blues I actually think I want to desaturate just a little bit and then hue versus hue same thing going to protect my skin tones there with my greens typically with an orange and teal look you're going to make these more orangey but for the sake of this video where green is an important color for us i'm actually going to bring back a little bit of that green and blue i'm just going to push even a little bit more to the teal side and that's pretty much all i would do in the curves tab so here's the before and after so I'm pretty happy with that color grade now. It's just a matter of going through each individual clip and making sure we don't need to make any specific tweaks to any one clip that might be a little bit different than another. So there you have it for our color grade. All of our visuals should match. Everything should have a consistent exposure, consistent colors throughout. So there you have my color grading process. Hopefully that was helpful. Thanks for watching and make sure to check out other Premiere Pro tutorials in this playlist. Link is in the description below.